Hi, Mr. Hemp Hill. I'm Kimberly Dawes. I'm a fourth semester MCC student, and I am here today to do my video on the medication of Buterol. The first thing that I will do is I will knock on the door to enter into my patient's room. Come in. Hi, I'm Nurse Dawes, and I'm here today to provide some teachings on the prescription of Buterol that your doctor has prescribed for you. But the first thing I need you to do is tell me your name and date of birth. Kamaya. And my birthday, April 26, 2006. Okay, this information that you provided is accurate with the information in the chart. Now I will go and perform hand hygiene before touching my patient. Hand hygiene performed. So now, Miss Kamaya, I am going to tell you a little bit about this prescription that your doctor has prescribed for you, Abuterol. Abuterol is a beta-2 adrenergic agonist. It is used for asthma and is effective for treatment and control by causing bronchodilation. So it actually opens up your lungs. There are many factors that can cause bronchoconstriction, such as environmental, which can be internal or external. Uh, it could be pollutants like smoke. Um, it could be like perfume. Those things can aggravate. It can be things like um, allergic substances. It could be like the trees on the outside when the pollen count is high. It could be um, food, it could be dust mites, it could be a number of things. And even some medications can cause you to have to use your medication of butyrol. It could be asthma, I mean, it could be ibuprofen, or it could be aspirin. A butyrol can be used as a handheld inhaler. They do have some handheld inhalers that you can use. Or your doctor can give you the inhalation drug. Uh, which is you will put in your nebulizer machine. We will provide you with a sample box of a butyrol to take home, and we will also provide you with a prescription. Right now, I am giving you some oral teachings of a butyrol, and I will send you home with these written instructions uh, um, for a butyrol. And if you have any questions, then you need to feel free to interrupt me and let me know. A butyrol can also be prescribed in a pill form. Most people use a butyrol for acute bronchospasm. Uh, Although some people use a butyrol for uh, prophylactic uh, medication, for, pro for prophylactic bronchospasm. If you feel yourself using a butyrol more than twice a week, then you need to visit your healthcare provider, contact your healthcare provider to let them know that you are having to use your butyrol too frequently. A butyrol is a rescue medication, so it's not a maintenance drug. And your doctor will need to make some adjustments to your medication regimen. If you are using a butyrol as a prophylactic drug, then you need to be sure to count your pulse rate before using this medication. But by all means, if you are having an acute asthma attack, then take your medication. Don't worry about taking your pulse because you need to get those bronchioles open. Abuterol do cause different side effects. It can cause you to be uh, have tremors. It can cause you to uh, your heart to palpitate. It can cause you to have uh, um, tachycardia, which your heart rate is feel like it's running, it's high. Restlessness, headache, dizziness. There, abuterol causes a number of side effects. It can cause allergic rhinitis. Can cause your nose to run. So, be sure to always use this medication as prescribed by your doctor. You can use this medication every four to six hours, but if your doctor tells you that you can use this medication before a four hour period, by all means, follow your doctor instructions. Do you have any questions, Ms. Fell, so far about Abuterol? No. Okay, now we will provide a, just a brief description on how to use your Abuterol. And this is your written instructions that you can take home to look back at. So, Ms. Fells has the nebulizer machine. <clears throat> and this is Ms. the tubing. This is the mask. This is her nebulizer cup. This is some of the vials. So, we're going to separate a vial. And what we would do is just separate this, your nebulizer cup, which will already be separated because it'll be new. And you will un strew, discard, and you will pour your medication over in your nebulizer cup. All you would do is put the top on your nebulizer cup 
And once you do, you will place this snugly up against your face. Make sure that your elastic ties are tight. And then you will proceed to cut your machine on. Take this medication in an upright position. Once your medication is complete, Miss Fails, you can remove your mask and then cut your machine off. Once you cut your machine off, be sure to always separate your, your uh, nebulizer cup and rinse it out thoroughly and dry it thoroughly and put it up for your next time use. Do you have any questions, Miss Fails, on a butyrol? No. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Hemp Hill. This is my management video. Mr. Hemp Hill, I did come back because I needed to provide my information on where my resources. I found this information on a butyrol in the pharmacology book, pages 519 to 520, chapter 36. Thank you. Now, this concludes my video.